What's up guys, Lucas El Coolio here. We're playing Nether. We're back. We're gonna go, hmm, let's see. I like going to uncontested servers. Let's go do Scared Shrieker. Connect. Um, so this is basically gonna be a quest for a gun. That's pretty much what's gonna go down here because uh, right now I have a character who I believe is close to level 10. He's like a nine, maybe an eight. Got him back. Oh, he is a 10. Nice. Okay, let's make him... Got to do the black on black on black. Alright. Let's do this. Oh, terrible spawn. Okay. I don't want to go anywhere near that crap. Is that a reaper up there? Yeah. I was going to say one of those guys looked... Uh, Kind of suspect up there. So, what we're really looking for right now is a gat. We need a gat so bad, it's not even funny. Um, so I have a pretty good machete uh, that I found, but still is no gat. Oh, there's blood in here, blood. Mm, there's some canned goods, there's five bucks. Let's go ahead and eat. We got some food in here, let's, let's eat it. Consume. Cool. Um, we actually went to town and I sold a bunch of my junks and I could pick up more stuff. Uh, I'd been playing and I actually had so much uh, stuff I was like full. Um, I couldn't pick up anything else. So, A blood trail. Maybe I should follow it up these stairs. Sure. Uh, one thing I was going to say is that uh, it is really helpful about how um, like or really helpful kind of weird way to start that I was just gonna say that um roofs have a lot of stuff is something that uh, should be known that I find a lot of stuff on roofs so that's probably gonna be my new uh, scavenging method is rooftops where is this blood going down into this building it seems just don't get seen by anything nasty yeah all that big shit up there that's where that reaper is we aren't, we're not playing around with that. Ooh, god damn, blood everywhere. Let's see, what's in here? Ooh, he's got a gun! Oh my god. This steam, this man, is a type of crawler. He must have been trying to... He's a new Biman. Yes, please, look at that freaking beast I just picked up. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Oh my god, I'm so excited right now. This is like the only time I've ever picked up a gun that's been better than um, a pistol. I am excited right now. And food. Doesn't got anything else in here. I wish I could take that gas mask. That'd be sweet. Um, let's see if there's a... Yeah, can't get out that way. Now we need to be careful because I don't want to lose this thing. Um, as you guys have probably saw in my last video... Oh shit. Um, I got killed by something that I didn't know. Uh, I, or I got killed by a guy that I didn't even know was there. Like he just jumped up on me and killed me. So we're going we're gonna to be careful. Or we're going to attempt to be careful. But I got to sneak my way out of here. I am pumped right now that I got this gun. And I'm going to be uber sad if I get killed with this gun. I'm sure this isn't the best gun in the game, you know, Mach 9, basically an MP5 it looks like, uh, but, you know, I'd like to have a long range rifle, but you know what, if I get into some close combat, I will be glad that I have this thing. Alright, we're just gonna try to creep around here. Okay, we're probably okay to move a little quicker now. Um, we're just gonna go away from this park, because I don't want to aggro anything in this park. It's gonna, it's gonna hurt me. Um, let's see, I don't think that other roof's even worth checking, but actually there is something, uh, that appears to go into there, we might make that jump real quick, this looks like it leads into something, so we're gonna check this real quick, maybe it leads to nothing, unfortunately. Yeah, looks like nothing. 
Hopefully there's a way down from here. Ooh, that's a big jump. Uh, is there any other way? I wonder if I can jump back to those stairs. Okay, let's see here. Yeah, this is, in my opinion, safer. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, let's get the fuck out of here. Uh, before some terrible fate befalls us. Let's go this way. Anywhere that's the opposite way of that horrible park. Actually, there's the safe zone right there, it looks like. Yes, that is the safe zone. Problem is, the safe zone seems like the biggest place to get killed, because that's where people are leaving. You know, they're all geared up and they're ready to go, and there's sometimes there's people who kind of hang right outside the safe zone. Waiting to murder you, shovel, sewing kit, canned food. Sure. I think I can hold it all, so we'll take it. Drop it later if we don't need it. Never mind. Never mind. Let's, uh... Almost got stuck. There's more blood over there. I'm gonna lay in this corner real quick. Oh, oh, I'm stuck. There we go. Okay. We are going to... What's the damage on that shovel? It's 220. I can drop that. I don't need that. It's a shovel. Can you dig it? Can't. Can't dig it, sorry. Okay. Another blood trail over here. Uh, just be careful here. I'm gonna be careful. I really don't actually need to go into the safe zone. I don't want to go in because it kind of makes you a target. Um, you got people who are kind of like gonna lurk outside the safe zone and you know wait for you maybe. So uh, we're gonna try to avoid it. Let's try to avoid it. Let's go. Just go down here. We can cut through this building. There we go. And my head, I have my headphones on now. I believe I didn't play last uh, another episode with headphones, so having headphones, uh, this will make it make it much easier. I believe I just heard a gunshot. I don't know if you guys heard that. Sound like a pop. Baseball bat, canned food. I'll take the canned. Nope, canned food. Can I not pick it up? Not in no space. All right. Actually, I could I could stand to eat something though. Got a lot of canned food. <laughs> And I actually leveled up, so let's, uh, character, let's boost the guns now, now that we got, now we got some guns, let's boost the guns. And I actually have a decent amount of ammo with this, though, that's not saying how much of this is gonna burn through if I have to bust somebody. I'm just gonna keep going this way. Camp over there. Mmm, you're gonna... Take it slow, take it slow. You know, and I like the third, I mean the first person of Nether much more than the third person of, oop, creature. Couple, ooh, big guy. Um, then of, uh, 60 minute survival, but that's right. Ooh. That's right, I've been alive for 60 fucking minutes, believe it or not. Done. 50 XP. Another guy over there. Leave him for now unless he comes and attacks us. I just don't want to be busting my gun. I'm not trying to attract that whole park to come get me, but what I was kind of saying is that I, uh, I just enjoy the immersion, immersion, immersion of, uh, the first person and that everyone's forced to be in first person, that there's no third person option. Because, yeah, you could say, Daisy, um, you know, you have the. I don't know, ability, I guess you could say, to go into first person, but no one uses it for the most part. Most people are going to run in third. Oh, ooh, that's a spitter. Uh, you know, it's way more advantageous to go in third person, but I definitely like the first. Um, definitely feels like I'm in the game. Headphone cord pissing me off. It's getting all tangled up right now. I don't really need to tangle with that guy, so we're going to avoid him just because... I'm worried because we're so close to the safe zone, and that's where you meet people, so that's why we're uh, being a little cautious here. Trying to, at least. We're just going to check our surroundings. I mean, oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. He didn't see me. Let's go slow. Let's 
Slow, slow, slow. Okay. We're all right. Um, you know, if it if it turns out like last time where I got a ooh, drop a little drop of frame rate right there. All right, back guys. Sorry about that. We moved a little bit. Uh, just got a phone call. Had to take it, the usual. I need to just keep my phone away from me when I record so that I don't even not forced to answer because I don't see it. Uh, anyhow, we're still creeping. You know, you have to admire though. This is some pretty beautiful landscape. It really. They nailed it in Nether as far as this po post apocalyptic goes. It's uh, it's quite impressive. Oh, a little quiet over here. A little, a little worrisome. We're gonna try to go up if we can. Uh, like I was saying before, I seem to have found the best loot in the tops of buildings. You do seem to find some good loot. That blood trail thing was really cool too. I've never seen something like that, so it is cool that they would uh, include stuff like that in this game. Alrighty. Search this real quick. And we'll probably level up our guy real quick too. Flashlight. Soap, canned food. Don't really need any of that. I'll take the flashlight though. I'm gonna hide behind these boxes while I level up. Character. Let's do another guns. Let's do it again. Come on. Come on, baby. We got guns. It's time to use them. So level 12 is the highest I've gotten in character too, in case you were, uh, you guys were wondering. I don't seem to live too long in this game, so I'm pumped that I'm a level 12, but we're gonna try to be careful here. So being careful, you usually stay away from stuff like this, but at the same time, you know, I still want to loot. I'm not gonna, like, play hide and seek with everyone just because I'm scared of dying. I still want to play the game, so we will be going into camps like this. Just try to do it carefully. Search this. Bottled water. Do I need bottled water? I already, I'm full. Looks like. Let's just consume it. We got a, we got a replacement right here. Alrighty. Let's creep on out of here. Oh, was that something? Oh, yeah. Got a spitter, it looks like. Right in the middle of the street. I'm not really trying to go in the middle of the street. Ooh, a car over there. Let's go ahead and keep going. But like you have to like just look at that. That in itself is impressive in my opinion. Alright guys, we're gonna search this car. Gum. That's it. That's all right. All righty. Looking good. Looking good. Keep on creeping. Keep on creeping. There's actually a tent over there and a truck. What is that? I don't know what that is. It's not marked on the map. It could be a little trader. Thing is, those aren't safe zones. So. Something I'm gonna be careful of. Do want to check that truck though? Could it could require a key? We'll see. Nope. Canned food, crunchy bends, cookware. To get crunchy bends, but I'm full up. Now yeah, it's turning night now. Now it gets scurry. There's a tent over there and a fire. We'll, we'll check this out real quick, and that'll probably have to be the end of the episode. I try not to make these too long, but at the same time, I try to give you guys enough content to where it's not like a little snapshot of what I'm doing. Okay, we'll creep up on this real quick. We got army trucks, we got tents, and a fire. Okay. Let's take it slow, take it slow. Never know who's around here. We're looking for ammo would be nice. Ah, 9mm. Magnum ammo too. 9mm is what we're really looking for with this gun though. But this looks like the jackpot. I don't see anybody here. Or it looks like no one's been here in a while because it's so... Playing cards. 
Can I even fit them? Nah, I'm full up. Well, we'll just take what we need. So, be sparing here. We just need to be careful. Be careful. Keep our eyes peeled. Let's search this. 45 ACP ammo. 12 gauge ammo. Hmm. A lot of ammo over here. Let's, uh, can we drop anything? Anything we don't really need? I got a lot of cans of food. Hmm. Let me, let me consume a can of food. Because I feel like having some different types of ammo is going to be advantageous if I happen to find a different gun. There's a box right there. Let's go ahead and take that box. We're going to loot this whole camp if we can. Just slowly and uh, methodically. Preferably. There we go. Shovel. Don't need it. Check the back of this truck over here. Empty. Okay. Continue on. Swing around to this side of the camp. Or 9mm. That's what I'm talking about. Or 12 gauge. Alright, guys. I think that's going to do it for now. Um. I thank you for watching. This has been a very productive episode. It's been Lucas El Coolio, and I'll see you next time.